Ang B o ang R o ang I Okay, lesson title It Okay, mommy will do it <laughs> Creation, how the world began You listen, peep Learning competency Then of the lesson, the pupil should be able to Know the beginning of all things Recognize, you listen And Recognize the God of heaven as the creator, order the events in the creation story. Okay, integration of faith and learning. Okay. You follow. Oh, you pray. We need to pray. Dear Jesus. Dear Jesus. Thank you. Thank you. For the, this opportunity. For the, this opportunity. Of learning. And knowing you, and knowing you through your word, the Bible. Bible. Be with me. Be with me as I study this week's lesson. As I study week's lesson. Thank you for hearing me. Thank you for hearing me. Help me. Help me. A bit, a better child to be. To me. In Jesus' name. Amen. Okay. Design. What is what letter is this P? R E D B I A P. So R is R stands for ready, E stands for explore, A stands for assimilate, and P stands for product. Okay, let's get ready. Let's get ready, P. During our last week of study, you listen, we learned that God made the light. Yeah. Did God made the light on yeah. the first day, babe? Yeah. Okay. On creation since the world is covered with a total darkness. There was no sun to shine. There was no stars to twinkle. Nor moonbeams to play through the night shadows. But even then, there was God. For he ever has been and always shall be the same unchanging divine being. Okay. Pip, you listen. Let's explore. What happened on the second day, Pip? God made what on the second day? Trees. It's a beautiful sky. Beautiful blue sky. You listen. Beautiful blue sky placed above the water covered earth clouds to carry the sky moisture. He called the sky what? This is heaven. Yeah, it's Genesis found in Genesis 1 6 to 8. On the third day, Pip, what happened? On the third day, Pip, what happened? Look, God made trees. Yeah, trees. What, what else? There's house? A, not the house, it's grass. Grass? Yeah, flowers. Flowers. Okay. On the fourth day, what did God do, Pip? Look, what did God do on the fourth day? Mm, sun. Yeah, and what? Moon. Moon and? Sun. Wait, look, what's this? Stars. Stars, okay. And on the fifth day, what happened? Birds. Birds are the fish. So who made all of this? It's? Jesus. Correct. It's God. Jesus. No, it's Jesus. Okay, it's Jesus. It's not God. It's Jesus and God is the same. Okay? Okay. On the sixth day, Pip, God made all what? The animals. Okay? So, huh? that, so that kids will be playing them. Okay. And what else? Okay. He created Adam, the first man. Yeah, because she's a party man. She always eat. She always eat. He, because it's a man. He, not she. He, he, because she always eat food then. No, she, she. No, he. God also created it. Adam. A girl. And Adam. And on the sixth Adam. day, on the sixth day, God created Adam and Eve. Okay. I'm Go together make... with the animals. I'm gonna write. Okay. 
Okay. And the last day, Pip, what's the last day? Seventh day. What did God do on the seventh day? He rested. What did he do? He rested. What did he do? He rested. Oh, he rested. Like what we're doing now during Sabbath? Every Sabbath, God also rest. Did you understand? So when we go to church, God is happy because we also rested on Sabbath. Huh? Okay. Okay. Okay, Pip. Let's do it. Okay, assimilate, Pip. Let me do this. God is the creator of this vast universe. He puts everything in order and in its right place. For six days, He made heaven and earth. So, what happened on day one, Pip? Look. Day one, day darkness. two, darkness. Day two, heaven. Day three, trees. Day four, moon. Moon and sun. And then in day five, birds and fish. fishes. And on the sixth day, sixth day, animals and 